about to knock her head off. She keep playing with me. <laughs> Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kyra Sean. Today's video is brought to you by Kalai Hair. They were kind of sending me another unit to review for you guys. Now as you can see, we're doing this a little different today because your girl wasn't really sure how I wanted to style this unit. So I figured, you know what, let me go ahead and focus on the hair and talk later. Okay, so this is the Kalai Brown Balayage 13 by four lace front wig and it is a body wave texture. I did go in and wash and condition my hair. Now you see me blow drying it. Brenda did not want to keep her head still for nothing. You see her keep trying to move her head around. I ain't having it. I told her slim neck to keep herself still. She ain't want to listen. So this is what happened. She about to get the two piece. There it is. Look up, look up. <laughs> about to knock her head off. She keep playing with me. <laughs> Okay, that's what happened. Don't don't judge me. I did go in and pluck up my unit just a little bit just to give it more of a natural look, but y'all gonna see how I wear this unit later. It wasn't really necessary, okay? Anyway, let's go ahead and put this unit on. I'm liking how it's looking. I had my glasses on so I can see to make sure it was straight and ready to go. Kalai does have some of the nicest hair that I've ever tried on my channel. I believe this unit is either 180 or 200% density. It's very full, it's very nice. This is not my first time working with this company and every single time that I work with them, I always feel like the lace is gonna be ashier than what it is. But after I start working my magic, y'all, that joint blends down like a dream. So I'm here for the lace, the hair texture, and the density, okay? Now, as you can see right here, I'm just tucking my sides up because I was being lazy, okay? I didn't feel like gluing the whole thing down. So that's my little trick that I use. I just tuck my sides up, do my little hairline so it's sitting kind of like a closure because I'm not really showing my sides anyway. And um, yeah, that's what I did. Okay, got my hot tools ready. Let's get this parted face together. Now I wanted to be a little extra so I am doing a zigzag part. It's more like a a lightning bolt. It's not an all the way zigzag, but it, it zags enough. Okay, you hear what I'm saying? You also see me using my wax stick. Y'all, use your products on your hair to lay it down the way that you need to. Now, I did go heavy handed with the wax stick, which I shouldn't have done because it made the hair a little bit shiny. Towards the end though, it does kind of dull out after I, you know, finish my hair up or whatever. What, what am I doing? What, uh, you know, you know what? <laughs> no lips were harmed in the making of this video. <laughs> If you haven't noticed already, I'm not really feeling the color as much as I felt like I would have. One of my wig babes by the name of Zazar Galore did style this exact same unit. She actually styled it in the body wave texture and it looked gorgeous on her in the middle part. I just wasn't feeling how it was looking on me. That's why I'm going in and kind of changing it up for myself. But feel free to rock it in the body wave texture. Just again, for me, it wasn't really hitting the way I wanted it to hit because the color wasn't sitting the way I wanted it to sit. I continuously have the bars, okay? 
But do y'all see right there how that color is sitting like that? I don't, I don't like, I don't like that. I don't like that, Kalai. I'm gonna need you to um move that, move it up a little bit, move the highlight up a little bit, blend it down a little bit, like make it not as harsh. That's that's like my main thing. Okay, make it not as harsh. But you know, we're gonna get it together. You know, in the end, I think she came together just as nice, but we're gonna we gotta get there first, okay? We gotta get there. All the products in this video will be listed down below, so you guys wanna check those out, you can. Here I am pressing the hair again. This hair did not want to press out. Maybe that's a good thing or a bad thing, depending on how you're looking at it. Um, like I said, this is a body wave texture. So even with the color job on this unit, the body wave did not want to come out. It was still like in the back of the hair. I could not press it out. Um, I did only have my flat iron on like 350. So maybe if I had it on like 400, it would have worked. But yeah, I didn't want to damage the hair because I did not have any heat protectant on it. And I still wanted the unit to have the body wave texture when I went back in to wash it again later. This unit is pretty long on me after 22 inches, so I did go in and cut a little bit of layers there in the front. And look at me, still using my products, okay? Okay, so now I'm gonna use my knot eraser to get my parting space together. Y'all, I'm hitting pan. It's not even pan no more, it's the edge of the pan. Okay, I'm on the outside edge of the pan to get the rest of that product out of there. I refuse to open up another knot eraser until I use every single drop of that color out of that pan. Okay, so that's what I'm doing. Okay, so we're gonna smooth this hair out, get it all together, got my earrings popping. I feel like this color will be hidden if it was blended better. A little bit more blended on that one side it will make me feel a lot better. But yeah, that's pretty much it, y'all. Let me know down below what you think about this unit, how you think I styled it. Shout out one more time to Kalai here for sending me this unit. I really appreciate it. I will put the direct link for this unit down below so you guys wanna check it out, you can. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Also smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. I love you guys so much and I will see you next time. Bye.